so I have about 30 days or so, which is around the time when my school starts to relearn French or to reteach myself French because I've been really slacking off these past three months and I haven't really looked at any grammar, touched a French book or touched a French movie which I should have been doing like a good student, but like a bad student, I didn't, so here we are. I'm gonna be showing you guys the tools I used to study for French, like the books, different techniques, or websites that I use. So before I actually start studying, the first thing I do is write down my study plan, which is what this notebook is for. It's usually just like planning, whatever my, whatever my study plan is gonna be. But basically, my goal is to study for two hours today. I'm obviously gonna take a break in between, but um, for the most part, I'm going to be doing a Francophone lesson, which is a lesson that I found on Canopy. I'm going to be listening to a podcast and taking notes, and usually for podcasts, I'll use my iPad to take notes. I'm going to be doing a lawless French lesson. I'm going to be watching a couple of minutes, like maybe 15 or 20 minutes of Call My Agent, which is a French TV show on Netflix. If I have time by then, and if I'm like still mentally present. I'm gonna try to finish off the day by reading Sherazade, which is the current French book that I'm reading. And I actually started this book a while back, last semester, but then school ended and I stopped reading it, but I think it's time for me to actually start, restart, redo it, reread it, start reading it again, because I never finished it. It might be a little bit unrealistic, but hopefully I can get things through. I wanna try to see how today goes and then change my lesson plan for the rest of the week accordingly. Anyways, let's get studying. So I tend to use a lot of notebooks uh, depending on what I'm studying. So if I'm studying grammar or if I'm doing my study plan or if I'm taking notes on a podcast, I'll use different notebooks just to separate things, but I will also sometimes use my iPad. Coffee Break French travel. So I've been listening to Coffee Break French, it's actually really helpful and I just listen to it whenever I have time so right now I'm actually going to be listening to it but sometimes if I'm out and about I'll pull it up, it's only about 20 minutes long. I'll take notes on my iPad pretty regularly too but I tend to prefer notebooks which is why I have more notebooks. Um, my iPad I like to reserve for maybe just like my podcast and like grammar lessons from Lawless French versus with my notebooks, I'll do um, other resources. Like if I'm doing online classes or anything like that, I'll mostly write it down on my notebooks. Also, this is the book that I'm currently reading right now. I'm not that far ahead, but I have uh, decided that I'm going to start highlighting as well. Um, usually I highlight any words that I don't know with this pink highlighter so that when I go back into my notes, I'll know to pay extra attention to those particular words because I, they're words that I have that I don't know or that I didn't know and that I should memorize. If I'm learning like for example new grammar I'll go for this one or for the green one. And if it's just like interesting things that I feel like I should know then it's the orange or yellow one. Excuse my very dirty screen but something that I've been using lately is this extension on Chrome called learn learning a language on netflix i'm pretty sure that's what it's called um i'll leave the name down below but if you download it on chrome it lets you learn language basically very easily it gives you the translation but also gives you the actual french uh i don't know what to say script and it lets you wherever you drag your cursor it lets you like désolé i'm sorry so if there's a word that you don't know you can just drag your cursor on it and it like translates it. So yeah, hope that helps. Call it spring, like everything is new. The sun bursts flowers, calling on warm days over to But I
I'm taking a break. Since it's break time, I'm just gonna read a chapter for 10 minutes to finish my food and start studying again.